Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name's Noelle and I do unboxings here. Mostly lifestyle subscription boxes, but also some stationery, books, beauty, jewelry, even a dash of Disney. So if you like unboxings, I hope you'll consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the notification bell. And as always, if you are already subscribed, thank you again so much for being here and welcome back. Today I have a new subscription to share with you and some of you might laugh if you've been here on the channel for any amount of time. And that is because it is a gourmet tea subscription by brew. Now if you are newer to the channel or you don't know why you might be chuckling, that is simply because I do receive a lot of tea in different lifestyle subscriptions, so much so that I joke that my tea cupboard is totally full and I am lucky enough to be able to give a lot of that tea away to friends and family and some of you in different giveaways. That does not mean that I don't enjoy a good cup of tea. I absolutely do. I have my favorite blends and flavors and I just love the ritual of brewing a nice big Big hot cup of tea and sitting down especially in the colder months of the year so obviously when brew reached out and asked if they could send me a box for review I was very very happy to say yes plus I think it's really fun to receive boxes from different countries and they are based in the UK and I figure the Brits definitely know their tea I also love the fact that the subscription is a little bit customizable you do kind of fill out a preferences form when you first sign up so that they can always put together a nice box that you're definitely going to enjoy. So this subscription is £10 per month for three different teas from around the world. That's about $13 US. They do international shipping and that's $2.99 which translates to about $4. So still well under $20 and I think it's a kind of fun way to travel through a beverage if, especially if you are definitely a connoisseur of tea and you like trying different blends. Now this was like I said sent to me for a review and I didn't actually fill out the preferences form so I'm very curious to see what they sent me but look at this beautiful package it just comes in this nice little flat box that has a little pull tab on the back so I went ahead and opened that up already but I didn't peek inside yet so right inside it's kind of cute it has like a little map here it says join the adventure because I do love any box that has sort of a travel element to it and then right on top I'm seeing a beautiful image that says turkey and the Hemshin plantation I'm not sure if that's how it's pronounced but I did really enjoy all of the tea that I had in Turkey especially just kind of the ritual aspect of it the social aspect of it because almost every shop that you went into you were offered a beautiful cup of tea and a nice little glass so you could really enjoy the color and the aroma and then on the back it's really cool it tells us a little bit about the blend it says it's Turkish rice and then it even tells us a little bit about the country of Turkey so that's kind of cool and again I do love that travel element in any box so it says inside your golden discover sachet this month you will find the Turkish rice from Hemshin a small town and district of rice province in the Black Sea region of Turkey 57 kilometers from the city of rice or Rize. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that correctly. Um, it just talks about how they brew the tea in these like double uh, kettles and then it also says next month they visit Iran. So that is awesome. Again, I love that idea. Now I'm not sure if that means that we're going to get all teas from Turkey or if there's just going to be one tea from Turkey, but this is what I'm seeing in terms of a product card in here. So let me go ahead and just open up the tissue paper. So I think their um, like logo is really cute too because one of the U's in brew is B-R-U-U is kind of shaped like a little cup, which is cute. But I'm seeing a little treat in here and you guys know that I love getting a snack. So it's just got a little card here that tells us about Be Kind and this is a brand that I actually really enjoy their bars. And they sent us a breakfast bar in blueberry almond and I think I've actually even tried this flavor before because we used to have the samples in the yoga studio where I worked and these are actually really delicious and not that bad for you like some energy bars and breakfast bars are great and they're great for on the go but they're not necessarily that good for you and I think these are these are pretty good so I do really like be kind and I I don't know if they always have that in these boxes from brew but it is a nice little little treat so um, okay so I am seeing a what they call the golden sachet so this is really cool how you can kind of see the tea through it so this must be that Turkish rice co uh, coffee tea that they sent to us so that's really cute and it's just got a little tear tab so that's nice and then you can see they actually sent us three different packets 
one of them my little clothespin on top looks like it broke but they are really cute they're like painted gold and I like that little touch now this is definitely a tee that I will like so I love how you can see through and you can actually see the beautiful blend and that is one of the things that I actually love about tees especially ones that have like flowers and fruits in them now this is an orange ice cream tea which sounds awesome I love that it's got the little pull tab but also it looks like it's resealable so you don't have to use it all at once like you don't have to brew a whole pot of tea um, so it just says orange ice cream what is it creamy orange aromas mixed with the sweet taste of vanilla think of ice cream on a hot day couple that with tangy apple and you have a delicious brew that sounds so so good it says that this is from Morocco I believe so I'm really excited about that I love fruity teas um, and I also love like orange creamsicle flavors and stuff so I'm really stoked on that one so even if the other ones aren't necessarily in my preferences um, that one definitely is so the next one I'm seeing looks like a nice dark black tee and the little card on this one so here here my little clothespin didn't get didn't get kind of crushed it says for this one KTDA so it's cute these little cards you can kind of hold on to them that one had the orange ice cream cone and then this one has like uh, like a tribal mask on it almost so let's see what it says about this it says KTDA a bright punchy black tee from the famous Kangaita estate harvest did 7,000 feet up on the slopes of Mount Kenya. KTDA, also known as the Kenya Tea Development Agency. Okay, so that's what that stands for. Sweet and malty. We absolutely love this everyday tea. Stylish, well-made, whole leaf tea, tightly twisted, high quality, and with a golden cup. So that sounds really cool. So we got that. I'm going to put that little clip back on there because otherwise I'll never remember which ones are which. So, um, so far I'm still really the most excited about the orange ice cream one and then finally we've got this tea right here and this one is called spring beginnings and you can see this little emblem I love the like attention to detail in terms of creating like a little like emblem a little like logo for each of them and this this little this little one got a little messed up too but that's all right so hopefully I can just keep these all straight um, so this one says let's see it says, what is it? A harmonious premium gourmet blend of green, white, and pie something tan teas. The scents from the initial opening become more prominent in the steeping stage. A desirable green with fruity kicks throughout. The palette is teased by a fruity aroma that makes this tea blend a real specialty. The combination of the different fruits flatters the smooth, fresh taste of the white. So that's awesome. So it looks like they gave me a nice like combo of flavors and types of tea, not knowing exactly what I would like, but I'm sure you could say if you like all green teas or white teas, or I'm not sure if they do decaffeinated teas maybe they do or black teas I'm definitely more of a black tea person but this uh, kind of like fruity flavor and blend with white and green tea sounds really good to me so I'm definitely into all of these and excited to try them but I still think the orange ice cream is going to be my favorite for sure let me know what kinds of teas you guys like in the comments below even if you're more of a coffee person or even if you don't generally like tea let me know. I'm happy to hear your thoughts or tell me which one of these three sounds the most interesting to you or you can even include that extra Turkish rise that we got in the discovery sachet. I just think the whole like concept of this and how they put it all together is really really cool. If you enjoyed this little bonus video you guys please do give it a thumbs up and hopefully I see you all very very soon in my next unboxing.